In another development now, farmers in Ogunland, uh, Ogoniland rather, are lamenting over the incessant invasion of their farms by herdsmen who destroyed their crops to feed their cows. The farmers who are, or women, complain that they have suffered badly uh, following the attacks by the herdsmen who destroyed their farms with impunity and claim that they have the right to any part of the forest in the area. During a day sensitization program on security organized by Lokiaka Community Development Center, some women explained that the destruction by the headsmen has brought untold hardship to them and their families. They said they have not been able to go to their farms because of the attacks, adding that some women are being raped by the headsmen. When they came into my community since last year, they've been destroying our cassava up to the extent we cannot bear it again. So our children, even my own personal child was there. My son, Destiny, went with them to pursue them out from the farmland. What they did was to bring out their dagger and their machete that they want to kill them. And that my son run, ran and left his bedroom slippers on the farmland. They carried their cattle, they entered into the farmland. And when they enter, they don't just enter. They will destroy as many crops that we planted. And in case if they meet you in the farm, if you are alone, they don't work alone. They work two to three people. The executive director of Lokiaka Community Development Center, Mata Agbani, said the meeting was to sensitize the women on how to be vigilant and more security conscious to defend themselves in case of attacks by cattle rearers. Government needs to start listening to what happens at the grassroots. There is need for them to increase their security force there so as to monitor these things. And then government should also come up with more enlightenment campaigns that can make people know what to do, like what we are doing today. We are taking up what government would have done to enlighten these uh, farmers to make them be on better gas, how they could protect themselves. The Assistant Commandant of Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps in the state, Bemisola Iyekolo, who took the women on some security tips, condemned attacks by the headsmen, adding that the government is working hard to control the situation. The Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps has a unit called the Agro Rangers. And this Agro Rangers is under a department which is called the Critical Assets and Infrastructure Department. And the federal government is trying to do their best in trying to take control of this menace. Agbani urged the government to pay more attention to local areas because there is more insecurity at the grassroots than in the urban areas. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.